hello students today we are going to learn about how to improve your english speaking skills english is the world's lingua franca children a common language that people with different native languages can use to communicate thanks to english that people with completely different native languages maybe hindi french and japanese can sit down and have a conversation together english now spans across countries and cultures and the ability to speak it well will open many doors for your career and social life children the more fluent you are in english the more interesting exciting and insightful conversations you all can have It enables life enriching experiences like traveling, studying and working abroad not only in the US but also many other countries where English is widely spoken children. The world is your oyster that means the world is yours. The other good news is that you all can improve English speaking skills without a classroom partner or stressful lessons. It's totally possible to have fun and master speaking a language at the same time. Pronouncing the words correctly is the key to eloquence, but it is not everything. This particular lecture will take you beyond the foundational aspect to reach communicative competence children. Now it will build a strong foundation. In order to express yourself eloquently in English you need a wide variety of uh, vocabulary and the correct pronunciation because speaking is the systematic act and process of making vocal sounds and it is an effective skill which provides an ability to communicate effectively it allows the speaker to express in a very meaningful and convincing manner It is known as the complex cognitive and linguistic skill. Speaking means an active involvement of sounds and words. I've tried to give you the notes as well, children. You all can write down in your notebook all these theoretical uh, uh, material so that you all can refer for your board exams here. Now, how to improve speaking skills? The main function of speaking is to communicate with others. Speaking enables us to share our views, ideas, opinions and thoughts effectively. How do you speak is very important then what do you speak children? Here are some important ways to improve speaking skills. One by one we'll try to look at total 21 points are there. understood children first is practice speaking regularly with preparation learn phrases and their meanings focus on spellings and pronunciation listen english lessons speeches music and audios talk to yourself in front of mirror practice speaking with tongue twisters think in english only improve listening the more you listen will make you better english speaker don't be afraid of mistakes remove fear be confident study english tenses which we all have done earlier only children improve your word power that means you have to improve your vocabulary practice reading regularly to improve your vocabulary learn the eight parts of speech in english listen english as much as possible be confident be curious stay consistent use all kinds of modern technology record your conversation listen it later on always remain in contact with english speakers read english newspapers articles and internet blogs always attend english seminars and debates watch english news movies and various tv shows now the first thing is about 
practice speaking and it will build a strong foundation children because if you want to express yourself eloquently in english you need a wide variety of vocabulary and correct pronunciation now in order to have a perfect pronunciation you need to expand your vocabulary learn new words every day learning new words day in day out is a good way to widen your vocabulary commit to a suitable target it can be three daily words or it can be 10 daily words understood children even if you only have time to learn one new word per day it is still worth trying by learning one word every day after one year you will have learned 365 new english words write the number down to remind yourself frequently if you have a learning partner share it with him or her so that he or she can check on your progress children some good resources for words are news songs and tv shows depending on your daily habits if you love listening to music pay attention to the lyrics and take note of the words you do not know phrases and expressions therefore they are great for learning english you can do the same thing with fluent you videos learn words in phrases and chunks children now this will help you out to you know enhance your uh, enrich your vocabulary it is important that you learn words in groups for example you prefer to uh, a glass of various soft drinks a cup of tea a pot of coffee etc it is better to learn those phrases than merely tea coffee so on so you can also benefit from learning words that are related the moon has four phrases during a lunar month crescent gibbon waxing and waning it is more efficient to learn all four words at the same time understood children now improve your pronunciation how will you improve your pronunciation children by you see if you, you might know a lot of words but if you fail to say them correctly you will not be uh, you will not be understood by others that seems like a waste of time spent on remembering words right so when you using online dictionaries such as macmillan or merriam webster make use of little speaker symbol to check the pronunciation of any word that you are not sure about there are english pronunciation tutorials on youtube like english pronunciation pod or american english pronunciation to teach you the many aspects of american english pronunciation because nowadays speaking american accent is a trend understood children do you if you want to go for american accent you all can use this uh, um uh, youtube or podcast uh, tutorials but if you want to stick to your old pattern of uh, britishers english because britishers were those who stayed for 200 years over here in our country and they have given us this language so if you want to stick to this old pattern you all can learn with different other tutorial uh, uh, youtube tutorials or podcast if you want if you are interested otherwise go for english american english pronunciation when you are ready for something more challenging try out tongue twisters also children some examples are available here personally i love the frog handle sketch from the show, the two ronnies it might not be a typical example of everyday conversation but it shows you are the richness you the richness of spoken english besides you will have a good laugh understood now the third is the learn the natural flow of english now what is the natural flow of english being able to say individual words correctly is great but the secret of speaking fluently in english lies in the flow of sentences whenever you read a piece of poetry listen to a melodic song or watch a hilarious sitcom pay attention to the following first is linking notice how native speakers link words together 
joining two sounds making a sound to disappear or changing a sound for a better flow this is we call it as linking children now contractions this is also very important if you really want to know the natural flow of english contraction is contractions shortened form of two words for example i plus am to i am he plus will to hill they plus have that means they have do plus not don't now these are the two important things which will help you to know the natural flow understood children now the third thing is stress there are stressed syllables in the word and stressed words in a sentences so you need to check out which word is stressed or which syllable is stressed and which word is unstressed and which syllable is unstressed you have to speak it accordingly rhythm may also plays very important role children the rhythm is overall result of stress contractions and linking it is ups and downs the musical feature of english now most important aspect of a year is children you need to build speaking confidence english speaking confidence rather understood because every one of us are very good speaker in our native languages but the challenging part is how to speak english with complete confidence the so one of the biggest barriers to developing english speaking skill is confidence it is certainly something that all language learners have difficulty with and one of the best ways to overcome this is to get out there and practice if you think you have got what it takes then get out there and practice english with strangers children that's right by following the tips in the video here in the lecture you will come to know the different techniques how to improve english speaking skills understood now speech shadowing this is also one of the important technique children in a nutshell this technique is about imitation you have to copy down imitate others you need to listen to how a native speaker says something and try to copy it understood children pick your favorite video from with subtitles first thing you'll do with english videos or english movies whatever you find suitable or uh, convenient then make sure that it is something you enjoy watching because uh, you will listen to it many times listen to the video once and read the subtitles to get a good grasp of the general content and flow while you are playing it again complete the next step understood then imitate the narrator sentence by sentence play listen pause speak record copy the speech pattern as best as you can if you choose to record your practice you can compare yours in the original or else just listen to your own sound and be critical of the difference or similarity repeat this step until the end of the video understood go on doing that now self talk self talk also plays very important role children talk to yourself in english loudly it can be anything from a suggestion like shall we go get a glass of water or a reminder i need to do a lot of load of laundry today alternatively pick up a book and read a couple of pages out loud this exercise might slow down your reading but it will speed up your speaking skill children you all can also record yourself listen to the recording and watch out for any wrong pronunciation if it is possible ask for feedback from a native speaker now most important is i feel in order to improve your english speaking skill is think in english children thinking in english uh, if you already think in english it takes less time to produce or res respond in everyday conversation no translation needed a good way to start to rethinking is to keep a diary where you express your daily thoughts in english it does not have to be perfect 
it is more about getting out thoughts in english with less and less effort understood then another important point is we tell a story in english this is the old method children and very good method to improve your language take the challenge a step further by retelling a story you retrace other people's line of thoughts in your own words i would start with a familiar story from your culture your translation needs to convey not only the meaning of words but all rhetorical and cultural nuances alternatively you can choose different words to retell a simple story in english start from the basic reading something like a fairy tale or a fable either way will be beneficial to your english communication skills frequently practice to improve your english speaking skill practice makes man perfect that you all have you all know very well children so do speak english in plenty some people think that they do not have the opportunity to practice speaking because they do not live in us or another english speaking country they might also be discouraged because english is not used at their workplace or they do not know any native speakers there is some validity in those excuses but do not let them hinder your learning thanks to the growth of globalization and technology you have more chances than ever to practice english speaking you will find many ideas no in your way then uh, you all can participate in public speaking also children public speaking see big universities theaters and culture society organize events like open debates spoken word reading and improvised storytelling gathering these are places where you all can come and mingle with like minded people and practice speaking english many cities are now hosting td or tad tech tdx talks where you can register to participate and share your innovative ideas check the event page of your local university to see if there are any available it might be a nerve wracking experience but it would be great for your english and uh, last important thing which i want you all to pay attention is you go to language cafes children if public speaking terrifies you i know it does for many you can opt for language cafes those cafes create a friendly and relaxing atmosphere for, for people who want to practice and exchange languages you can find language cafes through local universities or the meetup groups available in your cities then so of you go and choose your preferred method to expand your vocabulary correct your pronunciation boost your english speaking with the methods that are right for you and do not forget to practice as much as possible this was all about how to speak your english language and how to have a command on your english language that's all for today children in the next video lecture we'll have uh, uh, another skill uh, maybe writing or listening that will help you out to have a command in your language inshallah thank you